I went on my jog and the stone, I'm trying to lock my hair. So I don't know why it's not locking. I think somebody's right because I permed my hair April 19. But that's not the point. That's not why I'm on here. I am on here because I'm still going to try to lock my damn hair. Um, pardon me by future. I'm still acting pole. Like, you know how people like to say certain island men like to act like they don't got it, but they do. So there's somebody who has like a person that's like no call ID. And then the thumbnail is like a text message from the past person. Like, what you doing? And it's like, you text them me. Like, you're screwing yourself. You're, you're, you're satisfying yourself. You're going out. Like, the world card. Because whoever this person is, this Leo, or this person who has childhood trauma, because the sun is in reverse. This person is fake happy. They're going to act like everything's all right. I'm hearing that song, ain't no sunshine when she gone. She gone and she gone away. Ain't no sunshine when she gone. Like, you've been in Herman mode. Somebody could even project with the Six of Swords. Someone could even project, like, oh, yeah. Um, like, let's say this person slept with you, which they did. And this person has you become nonverbal in the relationship where it's like you stop to ask for help when you need help. But this person can ask for, you know, making love, a meal, money. And that become a very abusive because I feel like some of y'all have dealt with a family member or mom, dad, auntie, someone you used to live with where what I say goes. So it was almost like that in your relationship where you went and tell this person, oh, I don't like this. I don't like that. And I feel like the new you is nothing like the old you because the old you used to let things slide, no boundaries, people pleasing going above and beyond until you almost like bankrupt for a person and the new you have boundaries the new you don't want to be talked to the new you could literally sleep with someone and be like T i'm hearing that song like by tiktok like just because i fucked you doesn't mean i trust you you got some high hopes like you got some high hopes because somebody last person literally know and I, I feel like somebody has an ex that literally feels like confident that they know they fucked up your chances with love like anybody who dates you is like you gonna have like me and my old friends to say like PTSD towards it like you do not trust them like it was like a phrase we'll use like like you have a stress tr like like yeah you don't trust people let me just say that with the high priest you could be a cancer you could be a Virgo you could be an Aquarius, Taurus, Leo. And I think he was giving this person the world with the Hierophant. Mm -hmm. You could be a Taurus, too. This person knows you stay prayed up. This person knows you have a positive attitude, even when you're facing adversity, because you know that everything is the matrix. Someone watched the movie Lucy. Watch it. It really shows the human mind. Your manifestation will even get better. Watch it. Understand it. Dissect it. So may I need to go watch Deja Vu by Denzel Washington. That's why I like him. A lot of y'all confidence is getting better. I feel like whoever this Knight of Wands is, they could have a, a big stick or whatever. They was good in bed. That's how I look at the King of Wands. They're, they're known for being really good in the SCX. But whoever this person is, that's all they have. And you need more than that. You need someone who can help you spiritually, mentally. I mean, imagine I'm seeing, like, in my third eye and my ancestors, I share who's telling me, like, imagine you being in a relationship with someone and you have to pull yourself out of something mentally. Like, you could have lost a loved one and this person left you alone. Say they busy. Say they doing this. Whole time they with their homies or whoever the hell they with, vibing and chilling. Okay. Yeah, you really detach from somebody. I feel like people try to show you that that you're they crazy, but it's like you're the quiet one. Like, and I feel like you have one ex. It's like even though y'all on bad terms, it's like this person know you're a good person. This person knows that you got their back. This person knows your heart. And whoever would get you in the future, this lucky husband, this lucky wife, will be lucky to have you. I feel like you know the art of detachment. Like, you move on. Like, you ain't even studying it. Your new person will be attentive, very protective of you. 
and financially stable. I feel like someone, somebody could be like, you know, what's crazy. This symbol looks just like, like the the symbol of the like the police. Like some of y'all could be seeing symbols of magic, like seeing that witchcraft is almost like everywhere. Crazy. The Page of Pentacles, right? You have a bountiful amount of money and you have people that are competing with you. I literally had a friend that just texted me, just annoy people they're projecting. Literally. Still staying there. And just doing away. Yeah, somebody's going to give you a cash app. If you have something selling an offer up, Facebook Market, Poshmark, Macari. Some of y'all could be even posting it on Instagram because you have a lot of followers. Yeah, that shit's going to sell. It's like you're a celebrity. Something's coming in to bring you justice. Also, if you want to, you could donate to women for women to help women in Congo. I did. I feel like you need to stay away from somebody who's like careless. And it could be a cancer from your past. Somebody could have a cancer X, a Capricorn X, a Virgo, an Aries Leo Sagittarius. Somebody, and if they're not this sign, they're like arrogant. They just arrogant. You in your own lane. I'm looking at my custom tarot decks that I just wrote, and it's just I'm trying to read it. You in your own lane. Somebody's gonna come to you very swiftly to a text message. It's like, I don't know who this Gemini, Libra, Aquarius is, but it's like you don't care. You're not only protecting your peace, but it's like somebody wants you to care more than then they care about you. And when you caught on, it's like you, you learn the art of detachment. Like you could, re I don't know what it's about. Like somebody, like if you had the money that you want, you would be a menace to society. 7-Eleven, like you would be ghost. You probably would have gave your family members the last little chump change. And nobody will ever see you. Like, they know you will be okay, but you're either on the island, out of America, living your best life. It's, like, also, like, it's, like, giving, like, you, you will see how different your life is, like, nobody knowing what you got going on. Yeah. I kid you not, when I blocked my family for a whole year, due to the, the shit that went on and they said one person saw me getting abused said they wanted to call 911 they wanted to that that makes everything better the magician you're a powerful manifester somebody could be doing things with magic water air somebody could even be astro traveling getting better at it you be having like some high ties low ties but you're starting to see with the two of pentacles it's easy for you to make a thousand you just got to keep at it and be consistent. Like going for a workout was really good today. So somebody should go to the gym, get a nice workout. It will help with negative thoughts. It's like somebody wants to talk to you, but they keep thinking negative, like, and bringing you confusion. And you have inner clarity. Like, you don't want this person to say what you already know they are. I just feel like you want people to be they self. Whoever this past lover is, like, they're trying to come back. And I feel like for some of y'all, this person's going to come back when you're in a relationship or talking to somebody. Like, you could even pray, because I said a prayer where it's like, God, if you don't want me being with so-and-so and it was an air sign, just bring a healthy connection. And God just, boom. Some of y'all can say that. Like, if you want me to have better the love that I desire. And, you know, your person might have some flaws. Because let's not act like we don't have no flaws. Because, you know, some of us have shopping problems. We be shopping more than we be saving. We be holding stuff in instead of communicating that verbally. And then till you blow up, like, you be letting something slide that you know you shouldn't let slide. And you could have addressed it. You feel me? All are a work in progress. We should be praying more. But then instead of praying, we're stressing. Because whoever this karmic person is, they're still karmic. The lover in reverse, they're still going to bring disharmony. This is a person that just want to mess up your peace that you built for yourself. I'm, I'm hearing that shit from Snowfall. Like, me, I built this shit brick by brick. So I'll be damned if you don't like the way I fucking talk. Because it's like, somebody could even say, I even had an ex that said some shit like that. Like, I miss you being, like, mean. 
And I feel like, like, because I had an ex, it's like, oh, I miss you being tough and mean. So it's like somebody likes you when you don't care. And, like, when you don't care, this is the extended, too. Like, you know, it's like they didn't care about the kind, nice to you. And when you're a bitch, it's like you could kind of see that a man will be, like, so obsessed with you. They want to date you. They, you know, I'm going to buy you flowers. I'm going to do the things. It's like somebody likes it when you're mean and you don't care. And it's like. It's kind of unfair to you because you want the love where someone makes you soft, submissive, and submitted to them, and, like, in love and happy, and, like, your cheeks is, like, blushing, but it's like somebody wants you to be your own self-love, and it got to the point you got so good at it, like, you don't really need somebody love, like... It'll be nice. Yeah, whoever did whoever did this, they betrayed you so bad, bro. I mean, you could have walked in them sleeping with somebody, cheating on your best friend. Like, they did something where it's like, you don't trust people's words. You don't trust people. And I'm really sorry. Even when my homeboy was telling me stories like, oh, you know, he his, his homegirl got in a breakup. Like, he was telling her, like, oh, he ate it from the bag and whatever, whatever. Then another one where it's telling me that like, this person gave them something. He went back and all that. And it was like, I don't know. It's like somebody just did something. It could have wrecked your car, could have almost tried to drive your car to it, couldn't drive no more, made you bankrupt, and then you're stuck with them. That's the situation I went through, like, stuck living with they peoples and thinking it's all happy ending because, like, you're not helping with the rent. But, like, how, you would if the money that I knew I was going to give you was going to go poof. And then this person could have said, oh, they're going to help you get a car. You end up having to get your own car, having to get your own stuff. And it's like you learn to not rely on people's words. I even had an old Gemini friend say that, like, I was like, bro, like, I don't know why this person wanted me to rely on their words so much. And they clearly shown me I'm going to be taking care of myself. Like, and the person couldn't know how fucked up your family is. And it's like people don't understand. Like, people used to say that to me, like, oh, my God, Ayana only got herself. Like, she only got herself. Even her, like. Because you could even have family that was trying to portray you, too. Like, your mom have this, like, distorted image of you or don't like you and try to fuck up your life so you can have a fucked up life like her. And then, like, probably even come to you acting sweet because my mom did that. Like, oh, I don't want you to have kids like me and have it with a person where you have to take care. Like, someone acts like they sweet, but they really don't fuck with you. It's, like, it's given, like, someone's being coy with you. And I feel like when you walk in a room with the Aquarius, like, you give people hope and faith. And people wouldn't even believe the shit you went through because it's like you look like a nice person. You look like, you know, I can't believe this will happen to you. Like, yeah, you can't believe it. But, baby. And I feel like some people will even put you in the middle of an argument just to have you, like, looking at them like, okay. All righty. Because it's just giving, like, somebody just keep making you feel like you're not enough or something. And whoever this person is, this is a person, too, who's, like, really obsessed with materialist wealth. Like, this is a person, like, you could even have a friend where you they wanted nice things, that you would get them whatever they want. And they wanted to project, like, someone's really spying your life, like, oh, you don't have this, you don't have that. And it's like... The new Hunger Game would have taught me, like, you could take my humor, you could take my wealth, but she was basically saying that shit don't mean jack shit because I feel like the rich was, like, laughing at the people who are stuck in them, you know, um, because the districts, and it's like somebody just wants you to be a puppet or control your destiny. Somebody wanted to know your things that you went through with your parents and be exactly that. That's what it's giving. That's what it's giving. And they're a page of cups in reverse. And they see you're, you're going to be moving on. Like, I kid you not. Like, as soon as you get this money, like, you're dipping. And it's coming soon. <sighs> it's coming soon. Because whoever this insecure person is, very emotionally unstable, this person could have been bipolar, okay? And I feel like you was even loving them when it was bipolar, that that that's that's crazy you could be seeing a lot of u-hauls whoever this person is they try to do the bare minimum with the knight of cups in reverse like the bare minimum the bare minimum your new love is better than your old love you got the ten of pentacles and the ten of cups just be careful of jealousy and envy you're on the right path what you want 
talking about your aspiration. I feel like you have a spouse that you can trust. Because this bullshit is bullshit. Because whoever you was dealing with, this person will want to see you cry. The Five of Swords is like, you see how this person, they will do things to make you upset. Like, this person will be territorial against their homeboys. They'll even try to make it seem like you want their homeboys. And I feel like for some of y'all, y'all picked the wrong homeboy. Like, let's say one of the, their homeboys the real, like, plug or the real, like, you got the middleman, basically. That's what it's given. Like somebody wanted you broken. I feel like someone kept doing this traumatic shit because they they family member did this to them. The Ace of Swords. Can't make that shit up. You have a breakthrough. That contract with the person in the past is over with the Ace of Swords. You have a sudden shoes of happiness. And whoever this person is, they're broken, corrupted. Like as soon as like you left, it's like you took all your protection and good luck and your good energy and this person is fucking upset. That shit comes back. Like I don't know. I feel like some of you ladies, I'm talking to the spiritual girls. It's like some of these men get so airheaded. Like they thought that energy was dumb. No one was fighting with demons. And it's like, how are you going to treat an earth angel like bad? It's like, damn. 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 That is crazy. That is crazy. With the Ace of Swords, you got mental clarity of what you want. I feel like you're going to have a breakthrough with a new job, a breakthrough on getting viral, get a breakthrough of a new apartment, a breakthrough of new beginnings. 7-Eleven is like new beginnings, and I've been seeing that shit like, hello, hello, hello. Like, I, I get it. I get it. To me, I've been trying to figure out why, like, time been going fast, and, like, it's like God is trying to get you to, like, the 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 new beginning, like, the new apartment. Cause they don't want you stressed no more and they know you want it now. So you could be like stressed and some of y'all could not be even caring anymore. Like some of y'all could see like you're not caring about money. It's like bringing in this energy. Like you can have whatever you like the nine of pentacles. You're about to see the fruit of your labor. I can tell you that right now. Thank you for joining me and like, comment, subscribe for the ascendant. And yeah, I'll see you later. Bye.